the time where everything blurs out for me. The world blurs out. It's just, you know, me and my sins and my acts of ibadah and what I'm trying to do and what I'm trying to be. Family makes it special. I find, I find that spending Ramadan alone when I was in school was really difficult. I used to eat indomie for iftar. So now it's really nice to spend time with my family, to meet people, to break your fast with people, go for prayers together. So I think family makes Ramadan really special. I intend to be a better person this Ramadan than I was last Ramadan. Cooking? <laughs> I don't know if that's a stupid answer. But cooking, I do a lot of cooking. In my family, we do charity food for the mosque. So I cook the food for the mosque usually. So I get so busy with that. And sometimes I complain that, you know, I don't have time to do ibadah because I'm cooking for a lot of people. But then I remind myself that the cooking is an act of ibadah. In Ramadan, in my family, we usually try to make it a family thing. We eat suhoor together all the time and we eat iftar together. I usually break my fast with fruits. Um, I wear braces, so it's difficult to eat dates. So I eat fruits, I drink a lot of water, and then I claim I don't want to eat too much before I pray, but I end up overeating sometimes. And then sometimes I usually eat after taraweeh. And sometimes you're just so exhausted. But I would love, love, love to, you know, make this Ramadan better. better. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to the world. Haka de kumusaki hadu wa shirin muna magi diaries. So today I'm making quite on cabbage, but I'm going to do something a little bit different. Okay, so I'm just, I'm just chopping up my ginger and garlic to go with my salad and I have a special guest that is coming over for iftar later so I just want to quickly finish this up so let's just get this into the pan quickly so some ginger it's been chopped quickly and then some garlic to go with my minced meat so I'm just gonna chop that really quickly all right this is fine so all right so this is good Okay, so just a little bit of vegetable oil. I'm gonna get a cut in. All right, this is good. And to say, ginjana. And you know, kwado is just an, a very easy way to get salads into your menu for people who run away from, you know, salads and like, oh, I can't eat salad. What do you know when you have your kwado and then you have this, the kuli kuli on it, you know, it has this nutty flavor that adds to your salad. So it's just so easy to, you know, get to eat your vegetables fresh, which is, let me just give this a toss. Good. You see, musa means meat emu. And even if you don't have minced meat, you can even use dambunama. Some dambunama, I, you know, dambunama is this like shredded, spiced meat that is almost as soft as cotton wool. Like it just melts in your mouth and it has all of the spices just to add extra flavor to your kwetu. So it's not like the regular kwetu that you're eating. Okay. Okay. So, you know, having guests for iftar, it's not like um, people just want to entertain but then there are blessings to you know sharing food sharing a meal with friends or family or um even colleagues at work neighbors even people that you don't really know but you know that need help you know it's well encouraged in islam because it strengthens the ties of kinship and you just want to do anything that could you know help you earn more rewards in the month of ramadan So this is coming through. All right, this is almost done. So I'm just gonna season quickly with my Maggi. So I'm just gonna add one Maggi cube to bring out the flavor of my minced meat. So she will definitely want to learn how I make this. So just gonna get off the heat. All right, so this is good. So now I'm going to heat up some water just to steam my cabbage in. So once the water comes to a boil, I'm going to add it to the same bowl that 
get this into a bowl. Alright. Yes, this goes in here. And that's all. Quite well. So this comes here. Alright. Okay, so some onions. Okay, so this is done. My water has come to a boil already. All right, this is good. So I'm just gonna add this to my cabbage. All right, so add this to the cabbage and let it sit in here for a while. So it's gonna be here, chilling for a while while I fix my other ingredients together. Okay, so, all right, so tomatoes too. Let's cut them up. All right, so my cabbage is ready. I'm just going to drain this in the colander. Okay. All right, so. All right, so this is good. Okay. All right, so this is here. Ah, 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 ah. No. <laughs> oh my God, I think she's here already. I need to hurry up to get this thing fixed up. Come in, come in, come in. Let me shut the door. Anyway, I'm here for the food. Just go you know? straight to the kitchen because I was hurrying up to get this ready and I didn't know you would come so soon. Hmm. Oh, don't bother. You hmm. I can always help. Oh, uh, mm -hmm. I didn't want to stress you out this time around. I just wanted mm -hmm. to just stay and just eat this delicious meal that I made for you for Iftar today, inshallah. All right, so. Mm. I made kwatlan cabbage, you know, no, regular kwatlan cabbage because I have a cheese. So, but this time around, of course, you know, I always come up with twists to my recipe. <laughs> so, let me get a plate so that we can start plating because I know that you're very, very hungry. It looks Ram nice already. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let me get the plate. Um, Ramba, I think you should just go to the sink and wash your hands. All right. get in some cabbage so from all of those beautiful layers yes you can just give your hands a wipe there Rama. Imana and then I'll just stop <laughs> just by and eat okay. <laughs> okay so this is good so Yanzu will top it off with some tomatoes so we'll add some tomatoes to give it this you know beautiful wow. colors wow. I'm feeling like, full do you already. have to dress all of this before well, you, you know, eat the eyes eat before even the mouth does. Okay. As it's looking this pretty, Diane, so you came and then you saw something looking, you know, one she kind of color that you <laughs> <laughs> So, yes. All right, so this is good. I think you want to help out with this. Yes. Oh, are, you, are you sure it's not that one you want to do? <laughs> okay, so let me put the onions and then you put the minced meat because I know okay. your eyes are here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so some onions. All right, so. I think so. I think we should add a little bit of green pepper mm -hmm. just to no add better. some extra color. Fine, no, it's still here. Let me just, just hold this. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so some bell peppers. But really? Yeah. All right, so this is done. Just wanted to add yeah. that extra bit of color. So just have this here. See, it looks better. How about Rama? I think it takes time. <laughs> Wait, it takes time. Oh, yeah, la, Rama. <laughs> All right, so I'll put it on. Oh, it. I don't need this. Oh, it's always oh yeah the easiest way to do things. <laughs> I don't understand you. But it looks so pretty already. Sometimes you know when you do things and, you and it looks messed up sometimes, <laughs> but then it ends up looking like a good mess. So let me just um, sprinkle on some kuli kuli. So this is fine. We have a problem. Oh, what a pleasant thing to say to someone that is trying to. La, Rama, ya is a Allah. Me haka. After we spent all these hours trying to fix this meal, please just. I'm coming. Let me just put my gift. So go and sit down with it. I'm coming. Wait, Jamila. Where is the food for iftar? See the food for iftar. Ina kunu kosei doya dankali. Where is it? Kwanza dankali. I know you. I've got you. Don't worry. 
<laughs> I have something that you take with this. Kaki down, na Me, Nick, Nick, um, this one is enough for me, but don't worry. I didn't, I, I didn't leave you just like so some yaji. No, don't so, put that one on. Oh, oh <laughs> now is your turn. And of course, some vegetable oil. Hmm. I'm gonna add. So I'm just add a little bit of vegetable oil. We don't want too much oil, so it's Ramadan. All right, this is good. So yanzi Rama, just go and wait for me so that I can bring out what we're having along with our quet and cabbage special sure? from my kitchen. I'm afraid to take extra Maggie. Okay, take your extra Maggie. I know you. <laughs> Okay, Rama, I know you can't wait, but if Tar is finally here, uh, uh, you couldn't even wait for me. How about Rama? I know you have something hidden. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I made some semolina uh, fried bread so that we can have it with our quet and cabbage. Okay, so serve yourself first. So I've got some bread, at least you can eat it with it <laughs> before you say, I came from Budibaki and. I stabbed yeah. you. <laughs> I know you. In fact, if you want all my hands, I see it up in the shigida. Don't worry, I'll find. Mm hmm. Just get down to it. Nobody is watching us. <laughs> this is semolina fried bread with um, quite and cabbage. Tell me if this is not one of the best quote that you've ever had. Mm. I like that. I can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Very nice. It's tasty. Okay. Okay. Very easy. It's mm -hmm. mm. mm. It's just so good. Just like a lot of for watching. Don't forget to join us tomorrow, inshallah, for another episode of Maggie Diaries. Remember to follow us on our social media pages at Maggie underscore Nigeria on Instagram and at Maggie Nigeria on Facebook. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs>